Well, right now, I received a letter in the mail that they are going to judge today. And they're going to be at the um, Nevada State Library in Carson City. So the meeting is an open public meeting as well. And it starts at 1 o'clock and it goes to 5, uh, unless it's short, shortened for some reason. And uh, after that, they'll let us know by mail who they've picked for the top three. Then by August 20th, I think that letter should be coming, arriving. Uh, and what are they judging on? Um, as far as I know, they're judging on consistency of paint, painting, your resume, what you've done in the past, and how fast you can get an item done. All right. And then you submitted your resume, and so they're going to be looking over all the people who, who entered this into this contest, which is going to be ultimately a portrait of the governor, which is going to be hung where? I believe in the State House itself in Carson City, yes. And so you won't know for a few weeks what the results of today are? That's possible, yes, unless uh, the letter gets here earlier. <laughs> there you go. And um, so you're going to keep us updated on what's going on with that, right? That's right. I certainly will. And uh, you know how the mail comes. <laughs> I know that you're on your way to deliver some artwork up to where right now? Yes, uh, the winery is going to have an open show, and all the PAC members are invited to hang their pictures, three or three of whatever they want to, so that's fun. When is that going to be open? It's going to open today. Wonderful. Yes. So people can go up there and see the artwork at the winery? Yes, uh -huh. that's another way that PAC, Pahrump Arts Council, uh, helps all the artists in town and gets our artwork out, as well as showing at the courthouse right now, too. And there's one other thing that you would like to say. Lulu, tell me what that is. Yes, I certainly would. I'd like to thank God for my talent, and, and I just hope I please him in it. Thank you. I'm sure that you will. I'm sure that you have. And um, thanks so much for sharing this story with us and keep us posted. Thank you, Diana. Thank you.